Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. So in this video, we are gonna talk about on how to use Aliacard like a pro even in high ranks. To give you a brief context, this is my current win rate on Aliacard this season. If you look closely, I managed to have a high win rate, and there goes my history. Upon checking, you will notice that my average kill is at 20. Amazing, right? And that does not end here. I also play solo when reaching Mythic. If you do not believe me, just check my account instead. For your information, playing solo is not a joke. There will always be a high chance that your teammates are cancers, toxic, and more. And that is the reason why I make this content to help you in case you are in this kind of situation. So without further ado, let's start. So first thing you are gonna make sure is to look at the map. You need to know where the experience lane located. Just like here for example, the experience wave located at the bottom lane. That means, you must start farming jungle monsters besides to it. So your final gank destination will be at the gold lane. Always remember, you need to take down the enemy marksman as soon as possible. Do not let him take some bunch of gold. Because if you fail to do that, it is more likely you are fiving two cores at the same time. And that is gonna be a serious problem to your team. As a jungler, your job is to prevent that from happening. But before you join in any clash, ganking, or any team fights, make sure you are already level 4 or your ultimate is ready. Getting killed at the early stages of the game is also a serious problem. You will waste so much objectives that you supposed to get. So in conclusion, if you are at the early stages of the game, you need to be careful to avoid wasting important objectives and you also need to stop their jungler or marksman on leveling up by killing them. I know it is kinda confusing and hard to do but if you manage to master it, you will dominate the game easily. And after you successfully get some kills at the gold lane, your next rotation will be at the experience lane where Turtle is located. As you can see here, Turtle is about to respawn and while waiting, I am taking some jungle monsters to avoid wasting time. Do not use your retribution spell when the turtle is about to respawn. You always need to save it to secure the objectives. By giving signals, always inform your teammates to gather or let them know that you are about to take the turtle to receive some help. Just like this to avoid getting killed or ambush. But sadly, only Matilda responds to my signal. It is battle between 2 versus 4. At this point, fighting back is a bad idea. We need to retreat because we are getting outnumbered. Here is my secret tip. If you fail to secure the turtle, then you need to counter the turtle prize instead by killing some enemies. Do not allow the enemies to get objectives while your team got nothing. Always find a way to trade something so your team won't fall behind. Just like what I did to the enemy Saber. I killed him and even though they successfully secure the turtle, my gold is still the same to them. But take note, do not force yourself to take some enemies down if you do not have ultimate yet. Playing Aliacard for over 6,800 times, I already observed that Aliacard is kinda weak if you do not have ultimate yet. But if the ultimate is ready, he is so powerful. Just like what happened here where Beatrix trying to kill me. But he didn't know, fighting Aliacard with insane lifesteal and damage is not a joke. So, in conclusion, learn to play safe when your ultimate is in state of cooldown. But if your ultimate is ready, always try to take down some enemies. Do not also forget to take some gold plate after you successfully kill the enemy. Because gold plate can boost your gold quickly. And always try to observe the enemy's skills if it is still available 
or not to avoid getting killed just like what happened here, where I tried to fight three enemies at the same time even though I am not sure if they still have skills or spells. And because they still have skills, I ended up getting killed. I should wait for Matilda, but it's too late to escape now. Making mistakes are normal, just don't forget to learn from them. So next time, before entering at any team fights, we need to think first about their skills and if we can kill them successfully. And after you respawn, avoid being too greedy, but instead, try to take some buffs first and some possible objectives to catch up with gold. Do not also forget to last hit everything to receive extra gold. If you master to last hit everything, you can build your items in a way more faster than the enemy. And we all know that if you have more items than the enemy, you can kill and dominate the game easily. No one can stop you at this point. Just like what happened here, where I almost delete Beatrix and Saber in only a matter of seconds. Look at that damage. I only used my first and second skill, but Saber's HP is now at critical condition. Thankfully, Matilda managed to finish him, and I won't waste this opportunity to take some turrets and occupy their outer base and earn some gold from it. And after taking down some turrets, learn to retreat to avoid getting ambushed. Also, make sure to watch this video till the end to learn the perfect build path, combo, rotations, and many more. Because I 100% assure to you that this is very helpful in any kind of situation you are facing. Just like on how I carry my toxic team. You underestimate me in the first place, but I ended up carrying them while they become feeder. Sounds satisfying revenge, right? If someone also underestimate you and they become toxic, carry them just like what you learn in this video. So what are you still waiting for? Watch till the end and let's learn Aliacard with me. To the point that you can still win even with four cancers. Enjoy watching! Show you the art of killing. Nothing can stop me once I've drawn my sword. I miss Azria under the moonlight, as well as her silver longbow. Fear and surrender are not in my vocabulary. Launch attack! You have slain an enemy! Everything will come to an end. Let me show you the art of killing. Stop!
because I've drawn my suit. I'll cleanse this land with the blood. It's 